to you by Calvo Enterprises, it and Ambrose, Coast 360, and the Bank of Guam. Let's uh, go to the phones now where we have uh, Rodney on the line with a... He's got a complaint about the unemployment assistance here. Uh, Rodney, good morning. Hello. Hi, Rodney. Hi, Rodney. Yeah. Yes, hi. Uh, so uh, your complaint is that you believe you're not getting the full... Uh, pandemic unemployment assistance uh, benefit? Yeah, every, yeah, as it was described and laid out. And, and, and everybody, it's not just me, it's everybody. Because if you notice, they only issued out, they were already just a, a check to some people for 345 hours. That's not even correct. It's supposed to be, if they're going to do it that way, it should be 945. And if you recall, they already put in the article due to their delay for their reasons and excuses they gave everybody that would be retroactive. It has not been retroactive. So why why is there no one questioning that? You recall you recall that article, right? Do you recall the articles right. in the uh, newspaper? Yeah, yeah, I think it's uh, the three forty five for. Is it for the FPUC? And then. No. Yeah, the there's six hundred. Yeah. There's, there's two it, it's groups how, of assistance. Here's how, here's how it works. For the first thirteen weeks, it's supposed to be nine forty-five. Right. For the thirteen, for the thirteen weeks that are remaining, out of the total twenty-six, it should be three forty-five. Yeah. Yeah. So they shouldn't even be issuing out thirty three forty-five yet. What about the for the three months that everybody's been locked down and forced to lock down? Lost everybody, lost their job. Everybody's behind on their bills, months and rent and everything else and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. And, you, and, you, when, you, and, you, and when you fill out the form, the application, and you and I'm sure you have family members, and I know most of you are local here. So you already know that when you look at the sheet that they print, the application that they print out, it says the amount that's due you, the 13445 And then also, uh, based on their word, this is from the government now, that their, their first payment, yeah, their first payment's supposed to be issued out, retroactive. Then if they're still working after the 13 weeks, then they do the weekly thing to get the 345 mm-hmm. for them who are not working or just part-time. Uh, we'll put out a call now in the comments because I know people have been getting uh, the pandemic unemployment assistance. Is there anyone uh, watching out there? Uh, maybe if you could comment, has there, have there been any issues with you being uh, maybe shortchanged on your assistance? Yeah, everybody, everybody, everybody's being shortchanged because the first payout should be 13445 not 345 you just you, you tell me this. How would you expect anybody to get caught up on pay their rent, the GPA and power and all of that off for three hundred and forty five dollars after being locked down for three months? You of tell course, me that. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's supposed to be retroactive according yeah. to exactly, um, exactly. Yeah. That's the that's the point. That's yeah, the and point. people are getting retroactive. We, do, we, do, no, people, people are not. People are not. Everybody's and I I got a copy of the sheet. I can send it to you with the Senate anyway. They're giving everybody three hundred and forty five dollars. You know, you do you know the the Facebook Guam? Go to Guam Tax mm-hmm. and uh, Astra Sound at ETC, and you'll see everybody's showing a copy of what they're sending them. It's all three hundred and forty-five dollars. No one's got the thirteen thousand four hundred and forty-five. No one. So that's that's a scam in itself. And if you guys are not going to help, I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. I already got scheduled to go to Washington D.C. I'm going to get the U.S. government involved in it. Because oh, that's a, a joke. Now you're really getting serious. No, Did you... it's, it's, very, it's very serious. I don't know. What that, the, 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 the government of Guam has nothing to do with that. That was designed for the pandemic for everybody that got lost their, their, their job. Not for them to play with. They already made their money off of it. Look how long they held it hostage with all the excuses and stuff they were doing. You can imagine the interest they made off of it. In the first stunt, you remember the first stunt they pulled when they said they deposited into the wrong account? That's bullshit. Okay. Uh, that's okay. Bullshit. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Anyway, yeah, when you guys call, mind your mouth, please. Do you see anything there? Oh, I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm not oh. sure if you have to be a member in order to see. All right. Okay. Well, let's uh, take a break and try to figure this out. It's a 905. Again, it's containing COVID. The KUAM News Takeover, Guam's favorite. Good morning. Keeping you informed, KUAM News brings you Banking 671, brought to you by the Bank of Guam, the People's Bank, and Coast 360 Federal Credit Union. Together, we thrive. KUAM.